Greetings, mortals. Welcome back to Reaper. I couldn't resist. It just, it lured me in with its charm and humor. Um, I guess we're in the wilderness? What's Dark Harvest? Okay. A little exclamation point over here. I guess travel there. Level up. Choose one car from the Destiny Tarot. Block for enough incoming blows and missiles. Mighty slam. Concussion. Stomp range attack has 30% chance to stun enemies for 3 seconds. You know? I like that. Undo that one. Now can I travel? And this landscape is a tad bit different from what it used to. I forgot the controls already. <laughs> okay, there we go. Bacon tonight. <laughs> eh, lost that coin. Oh well. Is that not all of them? Are there more? Who's next? Whoa. That's right, button mash for spin attack. <sighs> spin attack up higher, doofus. Alright, where'd this pig go? Gimme. Okay, before I go into the ball of light, is this something I can mess with? No? Just candles? Okay. Victory! Gray hut. Oh, that's that dude from, from earlier. Now that I think of it, there is something suspicious going on. There's a place in the woods frequently visited by Imperial soldiers. They're always going. They're always going about all hush hush. Certainly up to no good. You might want to check it out. Interesting, or I don't have time. For Interesting, I guess. Isn't that the whole point of this game? Quests. Secret cache deep in the woods. Three Imperial soldiers are just about to bury a treasure chest. Um. Yeah. Let's. let's Let's do that. Okay. That is a lot of gold. I just stole you guys treasure chest. Are you trying to shoot me with a gun? Your guns are no match for my awesomeness. Good to see you. Wasps had me locked in all morning. A huge swarm. That sucks. Oh, do you hear that buzzing sound? They're still out there. Just one sting would be enough to drop me dead. Guess I'll take them out. Wasps, man. Oh god.
Are the mushrooms bouncy? Mine is tripping. Nope, nope, they are absolutely bouncy. Ah, there we go. Ah. Can I get the gold real quick? Yeah. I'll grab that one too. Grab, grab, grab it. Okay. I don't think I forgot about you, assholes. <laughs> Everybody, a lot of wasps. More wasps. How many outdoor rooms full of wasps am I going to have to kill? Looks pretty cool when they shatter though. On a similar note, bees are way cooler than wasps. I discover within the last couple of months or so that the the whole letting bees crawl on you thing is rather invigorating feeling. I like six of them crawl on my legs. They're all fuzzy and they're still flapping their wings and it, it creates a draft and so it's it's like a little little high powered fan. Oh What happened? I wasn't paying attention at all to my health. Did I did the did the wasps kill me or did I fall off a cliff? I I see there's an edge to this map. Isn't that just a load of bull crap? And for some reason, I am starting with my health all the way down at like 20. Can I just perpetually hover midair swiping? <laughs> okay, this time, don't fall off the map. I recognize that cough. Matt! We have been joined by our friend Matt. I am recording a video real quick. So don't mention anything about the bodies in the trunk. They can hear that. <laughs> I'm going to finish this level whether I die or succeed. And then I'm going to pause for a moment and come back later. Oh.
Okay. One more. One more. I think. Oh, you ain't gonna trick me into going off the edge of the cliff, you <laughs> bastard. That's the boss wasp. It's the queen. Hey Queen, stop it. Um then no, because I've never seen you actually do it. It's not working. Well you stop me. Get back over here. I want you to hide over off the edge. You're not gonna trick me into going over the edge this time. The only reason you got away with that last time was because I didn't know there was an edge. It was all covered in mist and, sh and light shading. All right. Victorious. And level up. Rage burns with the new begin. Um. Let's go ahead and start off with a couple skulls. Right. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Something is very wrong with all these animal attacks. Most curious. Anyway, thank you. You're very brave indeed. <laughs> I can he hands me three hundred gold, and I can say thanks, or you you know I want more. <laughs> Stone house is lit up. You said you're looking for work? I need to deliver a package to the Torkin tribe. Problem is, the Torkin are Imperium's number one enemy here in the wilderness, so it's not exactly easy to trade with them. I need to deliver because that's money. Weapons are expensive. Private Rolo. Stop right there. Whoa, you don't look local. <laughs> Are you aware that you're about to enter hostile Torkin territory? No one say yes or I don't care. Eh. Alright then, take off your cape, remove your mask, and put down your sword. This is an Imperial Pat Down. Let's see, touch me and you're dead, or I can't remove my mask. Let's say I can't remove my mask. Come on, I'm curious. Oh, really? Then I'm going to have to remove it for you. <laughs> really? I believe the proper response is, why can't you remove your mask? Survive the pat down. <laughs> I'll steal your gold. If I run into them, it does the auto battle thing. Okay. How did I die? I killed everything. The the portal showed up. Run into you till you all die. Oh, the. Freaking fire pit apparently hurts. We wouldn't think a 2D side scroller game that you know the background, you know, fire pit is probably the decoration in the in the background, the scenery, 
would have the ability to, to interact with you. It just wasn't something I was expecting. Right, survive the pat down. Twerking tribe. Aster. Cool. Behold, the black swordsman. The only way you dealt with those imperial canned worms was adequate. Yes, we were watching. We're always watching our borders. No intrusion shall be overlooked. Do you have the package? Good. You acted as a friend to the Torkin this time, so here's your reward. Just know this. We don't like foreigners around here, especially not tribalist vagrants killing for gold. Better watch your step, sellsword. I mean, $2,000, or 2000 gold, that's... You don't have to like me, just pay me. <laughs> up here. And Private Benno. I need help! Help! Somebody! Screamers have attacked us! Furry devils got the lieutenant! Black Swordsman here will help you! <laughs> what? Just volunteer me for sure? Thank you, stranger. Uh, uh, I need to catch my breath. Thanks. <laughs> you gonna let me do all the work? I guess we're going to the ambush site. And I'm being attacked by screamers on the way. The fuck? I love them and I hate them at the same time. It's like a hamster crosser with a monkey with screaming, leaping rage. Remember all the sword moves again. Die. And you. Who's next? This treasure chest. And give me them gold jelly beans. And jump over the fire, apparently. Oh, there's some more over here. Now that's everybody. There's a soldier dying in a no, there's a soldier dying in a pool of blood. His legs have been shred to ribbons. Please take me to camp. End his suffering right now or carry me I'll carry him to camp. Take that bloody mess out of my camp. What the hell, asshole? Put, and someone put a bullet in that poor thing's head while you're at it, will ya? You, are you, are your mind dragging savage corpses here? Don't you realize how terrible the men's morale is already? You're an asshole. Now you civilians, you'll never understand. Grab your finder's feet and scram. Well, fuck you too. Okay, I'm way back over 
out here again. I need to level up. Hmm. Do I want strength or more health? I think the last time health popped up, I got health. So let's do strength. If I'm remembering that correctly, I may not have actually done that. Let's do the health one for now. Good to see you again. How I miss the company of interesting people. Living in seclusion has a certain charm before, but these days, could I invite you in? Could I invite you for dinner? They say I make the best root stew in the wilderness. I would love some root stew for me, dude. Wonderful. Please sit down. The food mm, smells good. I'll be ready in a minute. I can tell you're not from the wilderness. You're not an imperial either, am I right? You must be from. You must come from afar. No one from around here uses swords. Certainly not us wilderling, wilderlings. Magic is so much easier. Here's your meal. Mmm, yummy. Mm, speaking of magic, Imperials came to the wilderness after the pretense that magic is dangerous. Well, that's not entirely a pretense. I mean, it can be dangerous. In the sense that a hammer can be dangerous? Like, you can stub your toe real bad or bash someone's skull in or build a house. What if some wild spell flew across the ocean and hit one of their cities, huh? <laughs> I know that sounds ridiculous, but Imperial people are untouched by magic. They believe that nonsense and demanded action. <laughs> Which explains Imperial invasion forces and war machines everywhere. The debris from that Eldritch ritual might come and litter our cities! <laughs> oh god. However, the real reason the Im Im Imperator in invaded us was the f fluidum? The first war was short. Imperium crushed the resistance, built fluidum mines in the south, and secured the fluidum route to the coast. At least fluidum is one I haven't heard before. <laughs> What is fluidum? A foul-smelling magic liquid found underground. Magic contained within it makes it burn better than coal. And it can be further refined to a potent gunpowder, which is perfect substance for Imperial war machines. Ironic, isn't it? <laughs> kind of. Well, fluidium is a natural magic absorbent. The more fluidium they drill and burn, the more wild magic there is. Fluidium Moors made their false claims about magic come true. Oh boy. See, at first the tribes were terrified by Imperial cannons. Now Imperium is losing battles to tribal sorcery. Spells that fly over the ocean won't remain a fantasy for long. That's still the, that image. And what is the Imperial answer? More fluidium for the war machine. It's an absurd cycle. No wonder many, so many young Welderlings join the Outcast fanatics. You are an Outcast too. That's true, but I don't fight the Imperials. I was cast out long before the wars. Tribal life is, well, let's just say that many tribal doctrines are worse than Imperial laws. Some might even be worse than taxes. Dang. I wanted to live free, so I've been forced to live by myself. Did you like the stew? I gotta admit, I've been tempted into hermit life so many times over the years. 
I like internet too much. And, and, the, and the people that I care about, them too. I'm so glad. Thank you very much for enduring my company. I know I talk too much, given the chance. Much appreciated. Travel well. Mm. Oh, more level up. That was quick. Speed, you go first, thunder follows. Ha! Ah. Enemy attacks fuel your rage. Ooh. I also really like that. So I'm always getting attacked by enemies. Let them feel my rage. You've been attacked. I get to test it out. Attacked by what? Another one dangerous looking candle. Die, candle! I have saved the day. Oh, hello. Are you just popping out of the ground like daisies? I need gripe about these tribal people using magic. Walking past these fire pits has drained a lot of my health. But apparently the enemies are all dead, so it doesn't matter. Any goodies to grab? Nope. Alright. Hey, could I hire you for a day? I'm going to visit my sister. She's not responding to my messages, and I fear something might have happened to her. You're in the security business, right? Sure. Is that... Up there that star is? Okay. I'm coming to this level expecting hyenas to start singing. Is that a ghost? You know what? Screw this. I'm gonna grab this gold before it disappears real quick. Alright. Now you have my full undivided attention. And kill the ghost. Here you die twice. <laughs> he just jumped on his head. Die. Oh. Come back, gold jelly bean. Ah, oh, no, I did one quick enough. I guess I should get speed. Hey, Juno, are you all right? I was getting a bit worried about you. Did she say I was her sister? Sister's just as cute. I know, look around. Idiot stormers trashed my shop and then attempted to burn down my house while I was sleeping. Luckily, I woke up in time. Pretty rough, though. I bet. What? Why would they do that? Because they were drunk? Also, because I knew their contract. I grew tired of them gossiping about my work all the time. Who are these stormers? Private security contractors. Thugs for hire. Who are you? <laughs> I'm tempted to say thug for hire. 
<laughs> you know, I'm really thick for hire. Yeah, good idea. Let's visit those stormers and break a few limbs to get their mind off Juno for a while. Alright. And up here. And these guys are purple armor. This armor's a little bit tougher. I am probably not going to survive this round. Nope. <laughs> Okay, first you guys. <sighs> Screamers. Ah. Change direction midair. Dang it. Ah. Get back over here. I'm gonna make sure I got everybody else first before I even worry about you. Build it. Change rage skulls. Steal your gold. I earned that gold nugget. Get back here. Got it. That was a bit difficult. Achievement unlocked. Fortune. <laughs> Oh, you're back in one piece. Good job. Hope you spend some of this money. I hope you spend some of this gold in my shop. Five grand. Wow. So you got a shop too? Now, what do you got? Talisman. Okay. Um. Back over this way. Forgot I had to hit the travel button. Should I sell my old sword? It lets me. Ah, screw it. There. 
and check this stuff out one more time. Alright. Alright, so where do we want to go next? Here. It's closer. Morka tribe. Fimor the Elder. Look into my eyes. Yes, behind that white face, you're pitch black. Wait, there's more! Yes, there's sickness inside you. You need to be healed. Apparently ran out of space for a recording, so I had to you know, make clear some space real quick so I could record a little bit more. Uh, let's go ahead and get through this scene right here. Um, if you say so. Yes, it's the highest time. I'll need herbs and mushrooms. Fetch me some Emanita, uh, Bolitas, Zavas, Pumpkin, Sage, and Black Roots. Yes, that will suffice. Okay. Well, we have to do that on the, the next video, so I hope you've enjoyed this as much as I have. I will see you next time. Die, Candle! I've saved the day.